1999. I'm going to tell you what you <laughs> <laughs> See, I told you, you needed to rehearse the questions. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> we should take two birds to this. We're going to conquer the world, baby. Or at least a piece of it. Just a piece, you know what I'm saying? I'll take a piece. I ain't got to have it all. ACK is the acronym for All City Kicks. All City Kicks was uh, the name that we came up with when we first uh, brainstormed on opening the Sneaker Boutique. Part of that name kind of reflects a couple aspects of of our lives. Um, first of all, we you know we we city boys. We like to be in the city. Uh, we you know what I'm saying we grew up playing sports, playing athletics. So uh, the term "all city" was you know what I'm saying was a was a recognition you got in your in your city um, that you achieved if you you know what I'm saying was selected. Uh, to be in the top of your, you know what I'm saying, your sport or whatever. So um, that was a reflection on our on our background and upbringing. Then it's something, you know what I'm saying, you can relate to, you know what I'm saying, in every city that you you in, you know what I'm saying. It's, it's fashion, you know, so. Like you see back there, you know what I'm saying, we bringing it from any city, any continent, across the globe. So ask yourself, are you all city? <laughs> In your city, <laughs> it could stand for other things though, but I ain't gonna go oh, into that. Cat. <laughs> I ain't gonna go into that on, on camera. You know what I mean? That's that's like don't put that on. <laughs> <laughs> you want to take that with it? What? It would kind of happen by accident. I mean accident and purpose. Um, we was doing a, when we first met, one of the things that, uh, you know, that we shared in common obviously was fashion. We started a, a clothing line. Um, and we did that for a couple of years, but in between doing that, you know, we would always, we would look at sneakers for our inspiration for our clothing line, first off. Um, you know, so we was, we was always paying attention to what was happening in the sneaker game. Um, and then as we progressed and we started getting out, traveling more, going to, to different shows, uh, we started meeting more people that was into, you know, in the sneaker business, different companies, sales reps, um, and what have you. And during that time, uh, you know, here in Grand Rapids, we really didn't, we, we felt like it wasn't a store that was bringing, um, you know, the style, uh, the selection, the variety of different brands that we was, you know, we was feeling. Um, so our attention kind of drifted from our clothing brand, Cooley Brand Clothing, established 99, you know, always and forever, but um, it kind of drifted, our focus drifted it off of our clothing label and onto uh, the aspiration of opening up what you see before us. <laughs> you tell them why we moved. <laughs> we we didn't know for sure, you know, division was gonna be be the spot where we was gonna be at for forever, you know. But East Town is where we wanted to be all along. You know, when we first was looking for spots, we came up here just trying to find somewhere to be. Hey, I just want we can retake this. But we still gotta get this on footage. We thought we was gonna be on division forever, goddamn it! As much work and money we put up in there, we thought we was gonna be there. So, so, so. 
<laughs> but it ain't work out like that. Right. <laughs> so we was blessed with this spot here where we at now, East Town, 1500 wealthy. Always can remember being in the fashion since I was, you know, young man, elementary, uh, looking at the videos, um, magazines, uh, the older cats in my neighborhood. Um, you know, that was those were my major influences, and I just, you know, it was something I gravitated to. You know, it was, it was fashion and sports, sports and fashion, and those and music too, and those things. I mean, that's. That's still, those are still my influences. That's where it all started from for me. I'll start that one off because it's my city. <laughs> yeah, I said it is my city. <laughs> no, nah, but I'm born and raised here in Grand Rapids. Um, you know, I mean, it means a lot to me, you know, deep down inside. I mean, obviously, uh, it's good and bad. Um, but, you know, if it wasn't, it, 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 I mean, I'm, I'm here, you know, uh, it's my home time, you know what I'm saying? I got a lot of, a lot of good memories, um, you know, I'm, I'm blessed to be here, uh, living a dream, really, because this is something that's always been a passion of mine, and I'm able to make a living off doing it here in my home time, uh, you know what I'm saying? And it's really because, you know, I met my man, my partner here, um, and, and we, you know, came together to do, do this. And then the, the support from, this, from the people here. Uh, I mean, without them, I wouldn't be here. Um, so, uh, I mean, I, it, it, means, it means everything to me um, to be able to do this here um, and be supported by my hometown is, is big, man, at the end of the day. Um, so um, I hope that, you know, people appreciate what we do because we, we definitely appreciate them um, here in the city of Grand Rapids. And I'm just, I'm just looking forward to bigger and better things, man. You know, man, I'm, I can't really say nothing else, you know. I'm blessed.